Hello and welcome to How to Play Millborns, presented by GatherTogetherGames.com. This video will cover how to play the card game Millborns. The video will start with the general concepts and gameplay, and then get into more of the details for the game. The game is played with two to six players. To play, you will need the Millborns card game. Each player is dealt six cards, one card at a time. The remaining deck is placed into the middle to form a draw deck. The object of the game is to be the first player to 1,000 miles. During gameplay, players will take turns drawing and playing a card. Miles are earned by playing distance cards and safety cards. There are distance cards, hazard cards, remedy cards, and safety cards in the deck. The distance cards are used to earn miles towards the 1,000 miles needed to win the game. The amount on the distance cards is the amount earned when played. The hazard cards are red and can be played against opponents to stop them from playing distance cards. The remedy cards are green and can be played on a specific hazard card to remedy the hazard stopping a player from playing. The safety cards are blue and protect a player from a specific hazard. Players' speed limit pile, driving pile, distance card piles, and safety cards are known as their driving zone and are set up in a row with safety cards being played above the row. A player's drive pile must be green in order for them to play a distance card. A speed limit card will limit a player to only being able to play distance cards of 50 or 25. The end of speed limit card is needed to remedy the speed limit hazard. These cards are played to the left of a player's drive pile. All other hazard cards can be played onto a player's drive pile to stop a player from being able to play any distance cards. A remedy card will need to be played on top of the hazard card for a player to resume playing distance cards. The drive card will remedy the stop card. The gas card will remedy the out of gas card. The spare tire card will remedy the flat tire card and the repairs card will remedy the accident card. A safety card played will give a player of the card immunity to the corresponding hazard for the entire game after being played. A player with the emergency vehicle card is not affected by a speed limit card or a stop card. A player with the fuel truck card is not affected by an out of gas card. A player with a puncture proof card is not affected by a flat tire card a player with the driving ace card is not affected by an accident card. Going back to the hands that were dealt earlier, I have flipped up each player's cards for you to see. In an actual game, you will keep your cards hidden from the other players. The youngest player in the game gets the first turn. A player's turn will consist of drawing a card and getting to play a card. Player 1 starts this game by drawing a card. A player will need to start with a drive card or have the emergency vehicle safety card in play in order to be able to play distance cards. Player 1 plays a drive card. After playing a card, play moves left to the next player. Player 2 draws a card. Player 2 does not have a drive card to start but will play a speed limit card against player 1. Play moves to player 3. Players will continue to take turns drawing and playing. The first player with a total of 1,000 miles or more earned between their distance cards and safety cards wins the game. If a player is unable to play a card during their turn, the player will have to discard a card. A discard pile is created next to the draw deck. When there is a discard pile, players can choose to draw the top card of the discard pile instead of drawing from the deck on their turn if wanted. During the game, a player can only play two 200-mile cards. A player cannot receive two hazard cards on top of their drive pile at the same time. A player can have a hazard card on their drive pile and a speed limit card at the same time. After a safety card is played, the player of the safety card gets a free turn. When a safety card is played in turn, it counts for 100 miles. 
A special play of coup 4A can be done by playing a specific safety card immediately after receiving the corresponding hazard card. Here, player 1 plays the accident hazard card onto player 3's drive pile. Player 3 is able to play the driving ace safety card immediately. When played this way, the safety card is turned on its side and is worth 200 points towards the player's total miles. By playing a safety card, player 3 gets an additional turn. Play then continues clockwise left, which may have caused players' turns to be skipped. The game can be played individually with 2 to 4 players, or in 2 teams of 2 with 4 players, or 3 teams of 2 with 6 players. Teammates will share the same driving zone playing areas. That wraps up how to play Millborns. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and find more game tutorials by subscribing to the channel, Gather Together Games. Thanks for watching.